Ghost Dance. Short to be drinking shitty beer. Welcome to another edition of Bands, Bikes, and Booze Reviews. Um, this evening I've got some of this stuff Ghost Dance. This was picked up in Aldi and um, it's touted as being one of their um, craft beer ranges. Now they do some pretty good ones from the Williams Brothers in there as well, but they also do their own brands and um, I'm not sure who this is brewed by because there's absolutely no information on the front or the back as to who brews it. Obviously Aldi don't brew it, they've contracted it out to somebody. Um, there's rumours that it's the Redwell Brewery up there in uh, Norfolk, in uh, Norwich I think it is. But I've got no evidence to confirm that. So as far as I know this could be brewed by anyone. Anyway, that doesn't matter. Let's just see what the beer tastes like. Um, what is it? It is a 330ml can of 5.6% from what I'm told on here. Let me get the bins on. One sec. Uh, yeah, it's 5.3%, sorry. 5.3%, um, 330ml can. Um, it is a pale ale, um, supposedly using Chinook hops which is an American hop that is actually quite hoppy. It's used for bittering and um, aroma as well. Um, it, it's pretty sparse on information. You get a lot of flim flam on the back. I don't know whether you can see this or not, but um, yeah, there's no, I make a big thing about the, um, the Native American thing on the front. I don't know if you can see that or not. It's got it on the, uh, on the can, Native American head. Um, it's got a Native American head on there, some blurb on the back about it, but nothing saying where it's brewed. Now, a lot of their stuff is done by Marston's. Um, as I said before, there's rumours this is made by uh, Redwell. Um, I've got no evidence to back that up, but if it is, they're not a bad brewery, so hopefully this will be reasonably decent. Well, let's get it opened up and see what's going on. So it's 330ml can, so I'm gonna pour it into here. Right, there's some, some citrus, pine, floral, and woody sort of notes to it um, but they're not bursting out they're very faint so I'm going to get this in the glass and see if I can get anything else from it that is the colour it's like a dark golden colour lot of carbonation in that head is dissipating so one finger head but that is dissipating at a rate of knots what we're we getting on the nose more of the same citrus there's a bit of fruit in there now as well a bit of mango peach sweet fruit um pineapple but yeah what you'd expect from a a pale ale yeah yeah so let's give it a go let's uh, get it down the hatch cheers Well, 
you've got the hops there you can taste hops in that um, it's got a weird aftertaste though and I'm not sure what that is and I'm not sure whether I like it or not I was getting some malt in that as well on the back end there's just a weird aftertaste and I can't place what it is No, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. There's something flavouring that that just isn't nice. And it leaves a long, long lingering aftertaste. And it isn't nice. It's not something to savour. <coughs> it reminds me of like cardboard. Sort of wet cardboard, that type of. Not that I've tasted wet cardboard, but it's not nice. I'm gonna give it one more go. It's like a grassy, earthy aftertaste that just isn't nice no I don't like that no sorry and this again Aldi are doing some some of their craft beers and cans or what they call craft beers the stuff from the Williams Brothers yet yeah, fantastic their own stuff I tried their hop foundry crystal vice and the triple hopped the crystal vice was just it was nothing it had nothing to do with crystal vice whatsoever this stuff it just doesn't taste good I mean, it's cheap it's what i think is one pound 29 but it's not nice it's got a horrible earthy grassy aftertaste that just doesn't go down well and this is quite chilled bordering on cold but no not for me three out of ten not recommended no sorry that's bad that is bad if i said three i'm not i'm gonna give it a one out of ten that's gonna go down the sink i'm not drinking that bad 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 one out of ten not recommended and remember life is too short to be drinking shitty beer like that <laughs>